Chronicles. Sunrise time. 6.36 in the morning. Uh, day 4. 70. Six, no, five. Four, seven, five. It's Monday. I'm in the van. So, we're going to see how this goes today. But, yeah, no, no more worky truck for me. I'll just, just be honest, I didn't really have a worky truck before. So, not really any different. But, uh,. Yeah, at least I can leave stuff in the van and don't have to worry about it getting gone or somebody else taking it or you never know. So anyway, it's kind of chilly today, as you can tell by hoodie and fleecy. Uh, we got a meeting this morning, as always. So we'll see how the day goes. I'm gonna drive now because the sky's not as pretty as it was. This. All right. All right, 7.35 Mopar time. We made it work. Let's go see how the day is. 4.53. I'm heading to the house in the van. Yay. So we're going to put it on the GPS. All right, well, it's 6.06. .06. We are home. And um, I'm not going to miss that drive. I swear I'm not. My drive's gonna be so boring now because I can like walk to work. So, um, no. Come on, let's go potty. Go potty. So, uh, yeah, I just had a kind of an ad mini day. I had uh, I had a meeting this morning and I had to enter some tickets. And I started to, um, oh. and he's back at it. Started to, uh, send more emails out, scanning. And I'm almost done. I've got like, I don't know, maybe 15 left. I think I started with 180. Maybe at, I don't know how many. I'm in the W's finally. So I'm doing alphabetical. Stop. Come potty. So, uh, Anyway, we got uh, kind of one lady who's like, I think I've mentioned it before, like how she's got a um, big carpet of bees and she's not waiting. It's been a week exactly today. Um, what's we call it like two days later? Still got bees. Well, yeah, because it takes a minute. And then she called like five days later. Still got bees. And the thing is, is that like I've went over this with... Uh, the two of the people answering the phone like extensively and i've emailed her saying you know it's going to take seven to ten days and uh so she called today it's day seven well no she called she emailed this was weekend so i called her this morning voicemail was full so i was like you know what i just want to send her an email so i sent her an email and, and i guess she called back in and i couldn't get it so it was like, I was like, well, did she answer whether or not, you know, he's, he can come by this afternoon just to make sure that he didn't miss an area or something? Well, no. So anyway, on the way home at like 520, I got two of those same people blowing my phone up. I'm like, she's on the phone. She's got her email cleared out. What did we tell her? Did we schedule it? I'm like, what are y'all going to do in two weeks? I mean, I, I, I don't. I don't know. Like, wow. At some point, y'all got to figure this out. So, <laughs> I don't know. And, uh, taught Andrew a little bit, not too much, but he was just like, you know, he's like, you sure you want to leave when everything's starting to get all jumping? Because we've done like 34 carpenter bees. Snow! Stop! and 13 termite jobs we got like three more three or four more pending that like we're going to do this week and next week and i was like well what really my call he said we mean when your call you're the one that bought a business or going to buy a business i said no i said 
offended. You know, me and we were. I said we weren't going to. I even said it on here. Like the plan was to just do kind of get started with nights and weekends, and eventually work my way over there. And it's like, I said, well, well, why don't you, why don't you stay then? I'm like, cause I didn't get an option. <laughs> and it was like, okay, well, since since you got this other thing going on, I guess uh, we'll just pay you for your license. And he says, well, why didn't you say something? I'm like, cause it's not my job. <laughs> I mean, I'll be all right. I mean, I, I got, I wasn't planning on going to Wolfpack like May 1st. I mean, it was just like, that was y'all's call. So, I don't know. He seems seems really confused by this whole thing. Like, I don't know if he's just... And he was like, well, what what work truck did you drive home on the weekend? And I was like, I didn't. My wife came and got me Thursday. He said, well, I didn't know. Like, the hell you didn't? I told you I'm leaving at 4.15 because my wife picked me up. And then Brandon chimed in and was like, I don't know where you were because I heard it. So, I don't know. He's got a lot on his mind. I'm not really sure. Anyway, but I'm starving. And, uh, just going to, I've got my tattoo goo, which you can't really, I guess it looks better. I don't know. It's kind of, I'm going to have to do more of my arm to see. That did come in today. Shoes to be coming, I think, Wednesday and my Indiana Jones glasses are coming sometime maybe this week or next week but I've got to get my reading specs put in them because they're just glass at the moment so I don't know how to do that I will be happy to have glasses that aren't broke so anyway I'm gonna feed him up and eat something myself because I'm starving all right so I'm doing my outro because I had a brat and I'm your brat. Uh, so I've been drawing and I made a drawing and it's going to be awful. Shall I call you Simon? Yes. Yes. <laughs> so I'll show it to you because it's going to be awful. I don't, I, why am I doing this? It's going to be awesome. But, oh, it's going to be so dope. Oh, it makes me hurt just looking at it. <laughs> oh, no. It's going to suck. Oh, it's going to be so terrible. Oh, boy. So, oh. yeah, I don't know, but it'll happen one day. Probably, maybe. Anthony keeps telling me, he's like, if you're going to do your sides, you better do them now. Because it's just going to hurt worse the older you get. And I was like... It can hurt worse. And he was like, oh, yeah. The older you get, the worse it's going to get. And I'm like, dang it. So, I do have two sides. So, we may just have one side done. We may just have, like, a little dot. I don't know yet. So, I don't know. I don't think you're that guy that would be like, no, it's too much. Well, see, all right, here's the problem. So. Tattoos hurt. Well, yeah, but I used to make fun of Vince Neal because he had this barbed wire on his arm and he didn't go on the inside of his arm. Because it hurts in there. And I'm like, what a punk. Yeah, because that, that was awful. I've got tons on the inside of my arm. Yeah, I'm just did. like, what a punk. That's why I'm like so mad that that's where all the blowout is. He's like so, he's so metal and so like edgy and like whatever. And he has this giant gap. And then he, like, added more barbed wire to it. I'm like, oh, did he finally close it in? No. He just added, like, this weird, like, circular thing on the outside. Because he's like, I'm still not going inside my arm. And every time I raise my arm up, that's kind of what I think. I'm like, this is the Vince Neal of a chest, a body tattoo. So, um, it bothers me. Also, it bothers me, too, because, like, I mean, I think I got a lot of tattoos. And then, like, I walk by a mirror and no shirt on. I'm like, eh, not really. I mean, I do, but... Well, you keep getting tattoos on top of other tattoos. Well, yeah, that's true. But still, I've got a lot of... I've and got... then you get tattoos on top of those tattoos on top of other <laughs> tattoos. <laughs> I've got so much canvas. 
Because, like, my back, I'm like, I've got my back tattooed. And then I look in the mirror, I'm like, I've got half my back tattooed. Not my back. Just... But half of your back is black. <laughs> yeah, but I'm just saying, it's like, it's not really like a back piece. It's like a half a back piece. It's like a, I don't know, it's like a six inch sub. <laughs> you know, I mean, yeah, you're eating a sub, but you're not. It's like a personal pan pizza. I had pizza, I ate a whole pie today. You did? Yeah, personal pan pizza. Little oh. six inch. Yeah, it doesn't <laughs> count. So that's my size. And I'm like, eh. But if you get one and don't tell anybody it was supposed to be two, will they ever know? I will. They're like, don't tell anybody. They're like, hey, raise your left hand. I'm like, mm mm. No. Well, that's when you just go, I've got plans for that side. Yeah. You don't need to tell them that your plans are <laughs> never to tattoo it. So, anyway, that's, uh, because I've got too much, I mean, like, I really don't have, I don't think I've got a lot. You so, do. but I don't, though. Yeah, you do. I've got a whole leg with nothing on it. You never wear shorts. Because I have a whole leg with nothing on it. <laughs> that's not why you don't wear shorts. It, well, it's a part of it. Because nobody's going to notice how skinny my legs are if they're looking at, like, dope dope tattoos. Yeah, they will. Well, it depends on if I get, like, vertical lines or maybe I can get the ring, ringlets. Ringlets? Stripes. Horizontal stripes. What are they called? <laughs> Horizontal lines. They make my legs look bigger. <laughs> the opposite of vertical lines is not ringlets. <laughs> <laughs> What's a ringlet? It's like the little tight curls that hang down like Shirley Temple. I thought they were called, uh... Curls? Ringlets are like really tight curls. Oh. Well, yeah, I'm not getting ringlets tattooed on my leg. Legs are... Well, you could, because they would still look like vertical stripes. That's true. It would just be a spiral going up your leg. So maybe one day we'll go to the legs, but... I got stuff to do, so it's going You gonna... still have two tattoos you haven't covered up I yet. know, I know. Ah, oh, this is awful. I'm about to do monthlies. I'll start doing that, I guess. I don't know what to do. You're hilarious. Why? <laughs> this is what she's doing. Why do I... See, even he's confused by you. I don't know. So anyway, long story short, I got a whole bunch of just stupid looking skin <laughs> that needs to be covered up with some ink. And it's going to be awful. But there's all these cool flowers and stuff around that thing. So you could kind of like... Make it even more awful? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it's, you know, I don't know. So... Maybe tomorrow will be okay. Well, you're not getting tattooed tomorrow. So. No, I'm not. So huh. it will be better than awful. Yeah, if I was getting tattooed tomorrow, it'd be like a day of awful, then it'd be a less awful time later. I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> thanks for watching day 475. Yes, day 475, and today is April 19th. Yes, I had to look. Because see, yesterday I was like, 12th, 18th, the 6th, the 4th, April, something. That's what was meaning yesterday. How is that? We've got 130, oh crud, four days? 138. 138 days, I said, When it gets to 120, that's like... Weren't we just talking about it being like 141 days? And I that totally wasn't three days ago. So what the hell's going on? It was three days ago. Was it? Yeah, it was, it was Thursday. Did I fall in a wormhole? A wormhole? <laughs> a what? A wormhole. A wormhole. <laughs> okay. Um, I, I don't know. I feel like when it gets to be 120, it feels... I feel like that conversation was like two weeks ago. Oh, so you think it should be shorter than that? Yes. 
Oh, no, it was just Thursday. Because I said we're almost there, and you were like, it's six months. And I'm like, no, it's not. Oh, because that's when I picked you up in Charlotte. Okay. Yeah. Now I'm, I'm not used to only working two days and then having two days off together. That's true. After having two days off, this is blowing my mind. Hmm. So it, it's it's a far away way, but it's not that far away, I don't think. In my head, it, it doesn't seem that unreachable. It is April, May, June, July, August, September, five months. But it's almost 120 days away, which is four months. In like three weeks. Mm. So that would be where that fifth month comes in. <laughs> well, you know. There's a whole lot of stuff going on between now and then. And, oh, I bought more clothes because... I, so did I. And she did. And I bought hair flowers. She bought hair flowers. They're pretty sweet. They're going to be huge. I don't know how they're... How I'm going to... I have no hair to attach them to. I know they're going to so slide out of your hair. Are you, I'll figure it out. You can attach them to your backpack. Well, then wear one on your head, wear one on your backpack. I'd be just, more afraid of it falling off my backpack. But you wear flowers everywhere. Just wear them all over your body. Have, <laughs> like, one on each side of your Mickey ears. I don't have cleavage, so I can have flowers. <laughs> uh, but I bought um, some more work shirts because I got a 40% off coupon, I think, from Gap. And I was like... I was going to get two things because if you spend over 50 bucks, you get free shipping. And I realized that one of the Oxford shirts I got was like 16 bucks. And I was like, well, that's a pretty good deal because you can't get George from Walmart for 16 bucks. So I'm like, well, let's go see what else I got. So I ended up saving like 260 something dollars. And I think I spent like 124. So. Uh, I mean, I don't care. It's last year's model, or whatever. I care about that? So I got some pants. I got some shirts. Button-down shirts are classic. They never go out of style. Yeah, but I mean, because the George shirts are at least on good days, like twelve dollars. The ones I was getting for work before. So. I should know the answer to that question, and I don't. I want to say they're like twelve. They're under twenty bucks. But they're definitely over ten. So like, I was maybe, thinking they were like nineteen, maybe eighteen dollars, something like that. But I think I got like on sale one day, and it was like sixteen. But even still, getting Gap Oxford shirts for the price of a George Oxford shirt is pretty good deal, I think. They're much better shirts than Walmart so, shirts because Walmart shirts are terrible. So anyway, does, I've, your, does your microphone pick that up? Yeah, probably. Okay. Because it definitely picked up the screen plug in the other day. Did it? Yeah. It kept playing banjo on the deck. Mm-hmm. Oh, and Tab Johnson's got a new thing. He plays banjo on that screen. Oh, he was doing it on that one the other day. Oh, God. I told you I didn't want to put those in there, but, I, yeah. we got to have something. We do, but we also have cats that are dicks. We do. <sighs> so, anyway, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to insert the picture at the end, and tomorrow we'll see you tomorrow. At the end? Why don't you put it where you're talking about the picture? Because I don't think I made a little break. Maybe I will. I don't know. We'll see.